Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is going to be a pretty cool review. So today uh, we decided to go to the gun range. It was me and a good friend of mine. He's a uh, former Marine. And um, we decided we were going to go shoot uh, 500 yards. The two objectives were to either hit 500 yards with a red dot, uh, with a fixed three power, or do iron sights. Unfortunately, I couldn't hit to save my life with a red dot uh, at 500 yards hitting steel. We had some pretty good winds and we had a hell of a lot of rain. My buddy on the other hand, um, he accomplished his goal as you will see in the video. Uh, it's pretty badass. Very impressed and uh, pretty excited to show you guys. So a couple things to note. One, I want to apologize about the sound. It gets pretty damn loud as this rain starts hitting. Um, two, I'm going to show you the weather pattern uh, uh, according to the, the app on the forecast in the very beginning of the video. Also, some notes. Uh, be worthy of hearing. Um, I'm looking at my notes here for what he was shooting because this was his gun, not mine. So he was shooting looks like the Ruger AR556 and a 16 inch barrel. The reason why this is important because I want you to understand how hard this is. If anybody sh is, has been shooting for a while, how hard it is to use iron sights in 15 plus mile an hour winds with heavy rain with a 16 inch barrel on a 556. Not once, not twice, but consistently hit steel. Anyway. Here we go. So we just wanted to show the actual weather today. So 500 yards iron sights from uh, this gentleman right here. And that kind of weather. At that distance. And you got to practice in every condition. There you go. That's the right. same. Next time we're coming out in a tornado. <laughs> Alright guys, you heard it. Hey guys, so we're shooting the Ruger AR556. Uh, we're going to shoot with irons down to 500 and hopefully we'll hit steel down there, which we'll see on my camera here. We're using the Target Vision one mile camera. So, best of luck to me. We'll see what happens. I don't know if I'm sighted in, but hey, we're going to have fun regardless. We're going to fire <laughs> some rounds, right? So, let's do it. This should be a hell of a challenge here. I'll try to zoom in real quick down to 500. All the way back there is five. How do we do? Eight hits, right? Oh, he's got a hit! Holy shit! Do you know which shot that was? I think it was the, uh, let's see, it was like the third. Holy third. shit! Alright, so here's what's happening right now. Are you still recording? Yeah, I'm still recording. So my, my rifle didn't come with a rear sight elevation knob. So I'm doing front sight post adjustments and I have no idea where this bullet's going to hit because I have no idea what the actual, with the ballistics of this gun plus the bullet, how much drop is going to occur at 500 yards. So um, I was aiming high and I was aiming low, kind of doing that Kentucky windage type thing. Uh, not 
a good uh, strategy at all. You should always make your sight adjustments. But hey, we're gonna figure out what uh, what I was doing there, and we're gonna get sighted in a little bit better. Maybe we'll come back here in a few minutes. And done. Uh, <laughs> and that's five hard yards with freaking iron sights. You gotta hit left, right on the corner, in the middle. Hit. That was a uh, top right. You need to come over about two inches and down about three. Maybe about four inches down, actually. Very good. Man, that was almost dead center. Yep. You're a little on the left. Uh, that's about as good as that's going to get. So what do you got to say about that, man? So, super five. <laughs> I guess you want to bring that up. I don't know. No, so basically, what you got to do, there's tons of fundamentals that you, uh, you can read about online, but what you want to do, you want to have fuzzy target, rear front sight post, you want to breathe, have a natural point of aim, so what you do is you close your eyes, take a breath, <laughs> let everything fall back into place naturally, and if that junk is right there on that target, as soon as you're in between breaths, you squeeze the trigger and you just let it go, man. You'll hit it every time. Fundamentals. There you go. This is coming from, uh... Hey, listen. Apparently now, Marines going through boot camp get to shoot with ACOGs and red dots and stuff like that. Nope. That's not how I roll. <laughs> Well, there you go. We, we thank you for your service, kind sir. Proof's in the pudding. That is proof in the pudding. All right, guys, we're signing out. So that's uh, 500 yards iron sights from uh, former Marine. 556 AR-15. People say you can't do it. We say BS, right? There you go. I remember, that's 1,000 yards, too, man. 1,000 yards. That's 1,000 yeah. yards. That, that's 556 five, Bearwolf. Yep. You know what I mean? Nine millimeter. Yeah, and Maryland can fly two round mag. What? Seventeen. All right. All right, guys. We'll see you back at the house. Oops.